Tonight, a desperate search for answers after an elderly woman was killed in her Buckhead home. Take a look at your screen. This is the person police are calling a person of interest. The victim, 77-year-old Eleanor Bowles, stabbed multiple times in an alleged car robbery. Atlanta News First reporter Yasmina Alston is live near Paces West Terrace, where the community, Yasmina, is devastated. Yes, yeah, they are and dozens of people gathered outside of Eleanor Bowles home here in Buckhead this evening for a vigil. And while her family is obviously in shock by this, the community says that they are positive that justice will be served. Amazing grace. She is just one of the most wonderful people that that you could to, could ask for a mother and grandmother, an avid gardener who was loved by not only her family, but her community. You know, her main hobby, I would say, was her golden retriever. Those who knew Eleanor Bowles are in disbelief. Family and friends gathered Sunday to remember the 77 year old who was stabbed to death in her Buckhead home. Our world was, was really turned upside down. It was one of her sons who found bowls in the garage of the house on Paces West Terrace. Now, as her loved ones mourn, Atlanta police are looking for this person of interest who was captured on camera between 1130 a.m. and noon on Saturday. Investigators believe Bowles may have walked in while the suspect was trying to steal her car, a 2021 Lexus SUV that has since been recovered in DeKalb County. I hope that enough people hear this awful story and understand this. And then maybe we can all collectively effectuate some change in this messed up world. Annette Loper attended the Sunday vigil. She has been friends with Bowles for 20 years. So stylish and she would not appreciate at all being termed elderly. She was the most young person that I even think I know. As police investigate, this community says crime is certainly a concern. She felt truly safe here, so it's quite shocking you know, for us as her friends. Um, but, you know, I think we can overcome this. And Atlanta police are asking anyone with any security footage to share that footage with Connect ATL. You can also call Crime Stoppers if you have any information and there is a $10,000 reward for any information that leads to an arrest. Live in Buckhead, Yasmina Alston, Atlanta News First.